can Darby possibly see or could be indeed? Is it poetry? A few words, perhaps a song or a melody? What could it be? These are some of the things I have come to see. How could it be? Me, doing all these things, you see. Well, welcome. It's a party made for thee, if you can see. The poetry, the words to show, the way I would love you to know. Indeed, you are free, free to think, to imagine, and if you can find somebody, indeed, to touch, to wobble with, to hold and to hug, to kiss, to see, shrug, knowing no matter how you look naked, you're in love, beautiful, unconditional, touching, communicating, making each other feel incredible. <clears throat> Indeed. What is incredible to you? This is what we need to teach. How do you touch the one you love to excite, to make them feel better than before your touch? If you only touch to satisfy yourself, your health will dwindle. Indeed, our wealth comes from the love we give, as well as the love we receive, a balance. If you believe such is possible, indeed, guess what? Twin flames ignite when it is right. Two powers equal and free not doing something obligated or out of need. Wobbling, you see, is touching, caressing, kissing, perhaps, but there's no need. Indeed, wobbling can be a simple holding of someone's hand as they are in bed in pain, praying, sharing, Allowing your energy to pulse into them, help them heal, feel loved, give them cause and reason to want to be here and not leave. You, indeed, can achieve a power to heal, to make someone feel incredible. They may be hurt from the love missing in their life. They may be indeed grieving for the loss of someone else or perhaps themselves. Yes, the I they thought they were dashed to smithereens. Through death, the loss of friends, the loss of lovers, the loss of mothers, fathers, brothers, sisters, the things that made the you and I that they could see to be that person, no longer looked for, no longer seen, no one else to glean by looking at you. Are you a father? Are you a brother? 
Are you a lover? Indeed. <clears throat> One might question, is it true? Could you be? Could you be what you look like? Is it you? Ah, you are fooled. Indeed. By the look. By the feel. By the touch. By the crook. Who stole your love. Who stole your touch. Who stole the things we love so much. By saying false things. By lies that sting. And all the other ways that ring in your memory. Thus we sing about the love story and we sing about our joy. The love we have for a mother or the pain we have when they go. Tell me why, tell me why do we question? Tell me why do we ask God to know that we love someone that we are feeling? Really, you must have us to know. So I go. Bye, guys. <laughs>